Paris. This is Gru and Blue with Artisi Frank on Frank TV. Welcome to today's episode. Life is unique. Life is not just situational or conditional. Life could be revelational and confrontational. The most important thing about life is the decisions you make on daily basis as a result of the situations around you. For some time on this episode, we'll be looking on the concept of decision making and today we'll be looking at the topic overcoming crisis. Oh yes, overcoming crisis. There are so many persons today in our world who are broken as a result of their daily challenges, as a result of what they have to deal with. Some persons, their shock absorbers have been broken. Some persons, their capacity to withstand life's pressure have taken away life's treasure from them. Sit back. I'll be back with you to take you on a ride that will reposition you for recovery. Welcome back. This is an inspiring program on Frank TV, Grow and Glow, with Artisi Frank. Overcoming crisis is our focus on today's episode. Oh yes, can we take away crisis from life? Can a man live without any form of turbulence? Is it possible that life could be without issues, life could be without challenges? That alone by itself is an illusion. Life is a challenge. A woman, a man born of a, a woman, is a few days and surrounded with so many problems. So it is not what comes to you that matters. It is how you react to what comes to you that matters. Overcoming crisis. Step one. Understand that crisis situations are normal situations. Yes, as a man thinks in his heart, so he is. You see, your level of imagination, your level of reasoning can either be your prison or it becomes your reason. Now, the way you react to life situation will define and how life will react to you. So, see crisis situations to be normal. Step two, do not allow the, the crisis of life suck away the positivity in you and leave a deposit of negativity in you. So, we need to be positive. Yes, we need to see the, the, the sun shining part of life to every situation. You've got to tell yourself this will end in praise. You've got to tell yourself I will overcome. You've got to tell yourself this situation will not swallow me. I mean this situation, the better part of me, the best side of me will emerge after the situation. Step three, which is the most important. Oh yes, it is pivotal and very foundational. Get close to divinity. Oh yes, there is no way your personality and your mentality can be impacted when there is a disconnectivity between your humanity from divinity. Oh yes, divinity is all about the God factor. We draw strength. I'm telling you the truth. We draw strength from the place of grace. Ezra once said, that the joy of the Lord has become my strength. Regardless of what you're going through, never run away from the place of prayer. Never run away from singing a new song. Never run away from church. Never run away from the place of fellowship. Never run away from the place of communication. Be close to God. Number four. I'm telling you the truth, the power of positive friendship. Oh, yes. No man rises above the people in his life. Who are your advisors? Who are your mentors? Or who is your mentor? Who do you commune with? 
Who do you discuss with? Who is your confidant? Many a times when life comes eating hard, you see people, they run away from God, run away from their spouses, run away from friends who will challenge them, who will inspire them, become the best of their kind. Oh yes, don't go away. I'll be back to share more tips with you that will help you overcome life's crisis. Oh, welcome back. You know, life is about the power of our thoughts, the power of our imagination, and the place of placement. You heard me right there. Yes, the, the place of placement. Now, on the conclusive part of today's episode, on overcoming crisis, I would want you to know this. Whatsoever life throws at you, you have the capacity to overcome. See, don't give in to depression. Don't give in to softness abuse. No, don't give in to situations and thoughts that will dismember you and destabilize you and take away your resolve and your energy to push ahead. You have all it takes to overcome. You are well created, well powered, well padded with the internal deposit to overcome. So whatever it is you're going through, you stay strong, stay bold, I tell you, you can overcome. You can overcome that fears. You can overcome that financial crisis. I mean, you can overcome that marital storm. You can deal with the addiction. You just stay strong. Now, let me give you a tip. The secret. Now, this work we hardly get around. But I tell you, is the best. I want to introduce somebody to you. I'm telling you, he can change you. He can transform you. He believes in you. He will not abuse you. He will not take you for granted. All you need to do is to talk with him and talk to him. And as I speak right at this moment, he's here with me and he's there with you. His name is Jesus. In the book of Revelation chapter 3 verse 20, he said, Behold, I stand at the door of your heart. All you need to do is to do what? Listen and open up to him. He will help you through life. He will support you through life. And I tell you the truth, you will come back smiling, you will come back and overcome. Thank you so much for staying with me on today's episode of Grow and Glow with Atisa Frank on Frank TV. Stay tuned to Frank TV. Watch us on our YouTube channel, Frank Online TV. Subscribe for our daily video updates and ministrations. It will inspire you and it will reposition you for greatness. Thanks.